Hi there, my name is Nuri Kim and I teach Korean history with a focus on the modern period from roughly the 19th century onward. Now my main research field is what can be termed the history of knowledge and I especially focus on the conflict between different types of knowledge regimes in modern Korea. As part of that, I grapple with questions such as how is epistemological authority created, negotiated, but also contested? And especially, how is scholarly knowledge defined, constructed, and set apart from other forms of knowledge? How is scholarly knowledge at times rejected and undermined by forces outside of academia? In my research, for instance, I looked at how Koreans, mostly outside of mainstream academic institutions, created their own scholarly practices, scholarly communities, and historical knowledge throughout the 20th century and how in doing so they were challenging the norms and assumptions as well as the authority of elite academic institutions. As part of this research, I take great interest in the history of religion since religions play an important part in constructing alternative knowledge regimes. I am also deeply invested in the history of historiography and historical memory, that is, how Korean history has been written and remembered by numerous different actors and in numerous different forms. Additionally, I am very much interested in new forms of scholarship, especially forms of scholarship that use digital technology to enhance our scholarly practices and also make our work more relevant in an age where the competition over knowledge and an audience seems to be fiercer than ever before. I very much look forward to working with students interested in these kinds of topics. At Cambridge, you would be able to work on research projects that have a historical dimension but that also relate to some of the most pressing issues of our contemporary world, such as the conflict between different knowledge regimes, the growing public distrust toward expert knowledge, but also some of the issues inherent to academia and academic communication. Even before the age of digital media, I believe that these issues have been pronounced in the Korean context throughout the 20th century due to the particular historical experiences of the country. I'd be very happy to answer any kinds of questions you may have, so please feel free to reach out to me or the faculty. I very much look forward to hopefully meeting you at Cambridge very soon. Bye-bye.